Oh, right. I was supposed to feed you. Poor little guy. Ah, Nevada. Home to all manner of folksy cryptids and cool dads.
Yeah? Come down to the basement. There's something I want to show you. The basement? What is it? Oh, it's nothing really. Remember, uh... This? Gah! <laughs> I love it! Where did this masterpiece come from? <laughs> Your Aunt August made it. When she was a kid. It's Lady, the dog we had when we were growing up. And Aunt August isn't a rich and famous artist now? <laughs> well, she is one of those things. We've still got a little while before we actually move out, right? Like... Yeah, about... The estate sale was... weird. Having all those people in the house, picking through Grandma's stuff. I'm glad it's over. <sighs> yeah, me too. Are you okay? Mom... I just... We took care of your grandmother right up to the end, and... And now they're selling the house out from under us. I know. Wanna just... Take a minute and look around and see what's left? I haven't really gone through everything since the sale ended. Yeah. Me neither. That sounds really nice. Just... looking through what's still here. Aside from this hell picture... <laughs> Amazing that no one bought it, right? Just shocking. <laughs> uh, so you're all packed up, right? Good to go? Uh, oh my god. Uh, Just remember that it needs to be done by Wednesday so we can get everything out of here on time. I know. So dapper. Was this Grandpa's? Wow, was this... was this taken right here? Cool. That's Grandpa? Mm-hmm. Probably only a year before he died. 
Of a heart attack? Yeah. Very sudden. But I guess that's how heart attacks are. quit already. Oh, how did this end up down here? Huh. Must have been in a drawer of something that got sold. This is from one of the first digs Dad and I went on. Oh, it was kind of adorable how excited you both got about going on those digs. I remember being so sure that we would actually find bootlegger gold. Or at least a clue about it. <laughs> Your dad. <sighs> well, at the very least, he certainly had a way of firing up your imagination. I'll give him that. Wow, a few pieces of pottery that my mom collected from around the world are still here. I'm surprised they didn't all sell. I think this one is from South America, I'm not sure which country. And this one's Japanese. I've never even left the country. Why have we ever gone anywhere cool? Niagara Falls isn't cool. It isn't Japan. Well, it's a lot easier to drive to Niagara Falls than Japan. Cheaper, too. But wouldn't it be fun? Me and you, an intercontinental mother-daughter adventure? Maybe an intra-continental adventure. Hmm, I'm thinking of a certain place. Somewhere warm and southwestern. Somewhere where, say, my own father currently resides. <sighs> Listen, we've discussed this. We're not going to Nevada to visit Penn. It's not gonna happen. Well, what if I just went by myself? By yourself? No way. It's a bad idea. How come? <sighs> There's a bunch of reasons. Like? Like, I said so, and I'm your mother. Is this? Some of the last pottery your grandmother made. Yep. After her fine motor skills started to go. It's still kind of beautiful. I miss her a lot. Yeah, me too. Good, some of Grandma's pottery didn't get sold. I 
loved watching her at the potter's wheel when I was little. Had she been doing pottery her whole life? Honestly, I think it's something else she picked up after my dad passed. Like the advice column? No, she was doing that since I was a kid. Did Grandma... Was she ever with anyone else after Grandpa died? Whoa, where did this come from? Well, she just seems so vivacious. You'd think some man would be interested. Yeah, no, not that I know of. Oh, hey. It's August. Ugh, exhausted. The state sale was a lot. But... <laughs> that's easy for you to say. Yeah, I remember. And the answer is still no. I... Well... The what? Oh, right. Right. Sorry, it hasn't exactly been at the front of my mind. Yeah, it's around here, somewhere. No, it's fine. Okay. Love you. Bye. Unbelievable. What did she say? Nothing helpful. Is she still not gonna help us with the house? No. She was just calling to ask me to find some book of hers. Any idea where it could be? It must be upstairs somewhere, in your grandma's things. It has a red and black cover, white block lettering. I'll know it when I see it. Okay, let's go! Hey, Ma! Actually, maybe I should just put this back. I am the very model of a modern major general. La 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 da 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 mineral. What's this? Oh, it's a hook pole thing to pull down the hatch to the attic. Could August book be up in the attic? With Grandma's things? Could be. All right. We can go up there, but... You go first. Hmm. Better leave these where Mom won't see them.
I remember hiding in here with a flashlight to read my books when I was a little kid and we were visiting Grandma. And a box of crayons, apparently. We'd come to visit and I'd hunker down in here for hours. If some kind of game in my head, I guess. I'd be hiding in here and I'd hear Grandma out there in her room, typing away or just reading in bed. I know she knew I was in there, but she'd always pretend not to know. And I'd pretend she had no idea I was hiding. I don't know why. I just liked the feeling of knowing she was out there. I have only slipped away into the next room. Somewhere very near, just around the corner. The poem you read at Grandma's funeral. Mm-hmm. Want to know something? Your grandmother didn't write this. I did. You did? Why you? Hmm? Well, you're not like a... a writer. Well, I don't know. I think I did okay. No, I, I mean, you did great, but, you know, I don't know. Were you surprised when they asked you to do it? Mm, I, I think her editor, she just wanted it to be from someone she was close to. I guess she was hoping for a family voice. I just tried to put myself in Millie's shoes. Well, you did a good job. <laughs> Thanks. Oh, somebody bought Grandma's old writing desk? And her typewriter. He said he was an advice columnist, too, and wanted to use them for his writing. He said your grandmother was a real inspiration. He left a very nice note. And a lot of money? Well, <laughs> it was just an old desk. But it had sentimental value. For us, maybe. <laughs> and for him, obviously. Can I see the note? Sure. Well, okay. I guess it's all right that he got it. <laughs> Glad you approve.